It's fire damage over there. What's your name? Timmy. Timmy. Who died? Girl. No one's breaking into this place. I don't know how we started before. At Christmas. Ben is using the paranormal puck too. Can you move your left arm for me? So I'm trying to make contact with the female spirit. So that's the front of the house. I just have footsteps out here. How did the fire start? <coughs> Bye. I said bless you. Tonight we've come to a very special house, the Polish house. Well, we managed to get in, Ben, didn't we? We did. Man, was that a struggle. It was. No one's breaking into this place. So, as far as I know, no one has ever been here before doing any paranormal investigations or ghost hunting. So, what we're going to do, exactly, that's what we're going to do tonight. So, we've got a few bits of equipment. The house is just us. It's not that big, is it, Ben? No, it's, it's not. It's a small house. It's been fire damage in some of the rooms. We're in the corridor at the moment, as you can see. It's fire damage over there. There's the front door. And in this room, there's lots of junk. As you can see, it's kicked something. So we're gonna start off, we've got the Coop Box 52 spirit box there. And over here, we have a trifold meter that is flatlining at zero at the moment. So hopefully that might change. And as you can see, this room is just full of crap. And we call it the Polish room because there's posters of like Polish calendars and Polish books, like Bibles, some sort of religious papers and that. So also some letters from Poland for family, etc. So I don't know who used to live here. You ready, Ben? I'm ready, yeah. See what happens? It should be quite interesting. Obviously lots of personal items here. You don't know who, whether someone died in the fire. Maybe that's why they just left it to ruin. You know, you just don't know. Don't really know the history of this place. So this is the living room and down the end of the corridor we have a shadow detector which is that big black box. And we have a mail room here. And this one... It'll go off any side. Any particular... See you look. Wherever you pass the sensor, it all come on. That's one of the other rooms. Got another room in there. This is the fire damage room that we will be in later. Okay, if there's any spirits left in this house, I ask you to come forward, speak to us, tell me your name. My name is Mickey. And we also have Ben. Can you tell us your name, please? You don't need to be afraid of us. It's just the two of us in this little house. We don't really know much, so we'd like to find out some things about this building. Like, why was there a fire? It's 
Just don't kick it. What's your name? Timmy. Timmy. That was clear, wasn't it? Yeah. Timmy. Timmy. Hello, Timmy. Nice to meet you. Which room are you in? Is it possible for you to tell me? So, Timmy, my name is Mickey, as I said. Nice to meet you. Can you walk into the corridor for me? Can you tell me yes on this device? God. God? That's a God. That's a God of Cal. Okay, can you repeat it? Sorry. Timmy. Hello. Was this your house? <laughs> Possibly a yes, I'm not sure. Did you live here? Are we going male or female for Timmy? Male. Male, yeah. Oh, we can just ask. Timmy, are you male or female? Hello. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Because I know foreign women are called Timmy, or female. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. And this is a Polish house. And Eastern Europeans have that, that name as a female. Oh. Hey. Hey. <laughs> Which country were you born in? See, it's definitely a female, isn't it? Mm. There's two boxes on the floor. One has a red light on. If you go near that, there's an antenna, a metal thing sticking out the top. Drip. It's a drip or trip. Trip. If you touch it, the alarm goes off. Lots of sound, and the other black box, if you go near it, the lights will come on. Different lights, different parts of the box. What's his name? You, you. How many years did you live in this house? Can you tell me that? I'm... Did you have any children? I've just put fire and it's just come back where? Who? Who? Where? Ben is using the Paranormal Puck 2. We've got the Coot Box 52, Spirit Box going. Got the Shadow Detector and the Mel Ram. Bottom of the corridor. I just put um, this house, it come back mostly. Yeah? Yeah. See, what fire, where, this house, mostly. Wow. Yeah, because it's only a bit of the house. It's like mostly one side, isn't it? Oh. 
This is like kicking off. Oh, Dead did. justice. Oh, it's going to hear died. Who died? Girl. Timmy, are you still here with us? Help. 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 Do you know what? It's funny. No. Oh. Check what just says there. Polish, do run. Does that mean you need to run from this house? Or they have to run because of the fire? And she just said, help, didn't she? Yeah. Oh, wow. Timmy, did you run? Would you rather speak to Ben through that device? Some of the things, yes. Some of the things you're getting on that is amazing. Put in family. Yeah. I says above. In heaven. Or. Can you speak to us some more on the spirit box? Collect. I put in talk to her and it says malevolent. How did the fire start? Can you tell us? What happened? Well, no. Well, but who started the fire? Yeah. Think of all the stuff that we've seen in this house. What's it to do with? Photography. Canon. I see that. Is it a Canon camera? Is that like Canon? There. Maybe back in the day, I don't know. Electrical fire. Yeah, there's so many photography books date, dating back to the 50s. That puck is awesome tonight. Oh, it is. Fight. Who died? Alice. I've had an Alice. I've had an Alice die before at Christmas. Oh, yeah. She couldn't have died here as well. No, the opposite is just not going anywhere. Oh, what? I mean, it's just following you. <laughs> it's following Ben from Crispin's. Because of that puck. No, I thought that just said he died now. <laughs> Bit weird, but. Right, so now we're going to try and capture some voices. See if they want to talk to us in this house. Ben is going to continue on the puck. And uh, I'll do little burst sessions, yeah, Ben? Yeah. Yeah, cool. So I'm calling out for the spirits in this house. My name is Mickey and this is Ben. My name is Mickey and this is Ben. Can you tell me your name, please? So I'm trying to make contact with the female spirit of Timmy. That's right, isn't it, Timmy? Hello, Timmy. Did people die in the fire? See, that's where I turn the spirit box off, and that sort of stops. It's like they're working together. Yeah. Isn't it? That is weird. So we go in the, in the fire room. So this was the main room that was damaged by the fire. Spread into the ceiling. The doors, the walls. 
the front of the house. Well, room is on fire. Poltergeist. Oh, nice. If there's a poltergeist in here, can you walk down the corridor? Because I can still see the lights down there. And they'll turn on if you walk past them. Is that possible? So that's the front of the house, behind 30 foot of brambles. So obviously this house has just been left. There's a main road up there and there's your carriageway about 100 yards away. So not many people venture into this property. Pretty much been left as it was when it was abandoned, I'm sure. Lots of pillboxes everywhere, photography stuff, books, Polish items. Right, so I'm in this dining area. Lots of broken glass, old photography items. Let's go back into the fire room, see if we can get some answers. Yeah. And it just says correct. Oh, wow. So there was definitely a fire, yeah? <laughs> Obviously. Well, I'm trying to speak to Timmy. Is Timmy still here? Timmy was in this room. Is this where Timmy is? Are you from Poland? Hello. Hello. So many uh, old items in here, old books, letters from family. You just left them. Why did you leave them? Are you walking out here, Ben? Ben, are you walking? No. Fuck off. I just heard footsteps out here. So I thought it was you. No, I've been for ages, mate. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Oh. Yes, yeah, so I heard footsteps then. Yeah. thought it was Ben. Hello. Catalika. What is Catalika? Can you tell me? Is there anyone in this room? I know the kitchen's over there. Uh, 
Can you make me some food? I'm hungry. Very hungry. Word. Word. Yeah, the books have words in. Can you say bless me? What did I do? What, can you say goodbye on this device for me? Bye. I say bless you. Right, so now I'm going to do a sweep of the building. Look at SLS camera. So come on, spirits, you can show yourselves now. I might be able to see you. Ben's walking around with a device that lets him see your form, your shape. So I'm asking you to walk in front of Ben. Is that possible? He can see you, pick you up. In the corner. Oh wow. Can you move your legs? So we're over there. That's facing that corner, isn't it? Well, it's actually on that bit of the wall. Yeah. So it's not even on the door frame. So it's on that part. Wow. Can you move your left arm for me? Looks like his head's dropping. Dancing. Are you trapped here? What's he doing there? Uh -huh. See, that's totally over that side now. He's still there. That's over in that corner. That's that flat ball there then. Yeah, that's the fireplace. Yeah, above the fireplace. What is he doing? Can you jump and dance? hardly ever get anything picked up on this SLS. But that's weird, it's not there it's anymore. It's gone now. And you had him in that side of the wall, you moved it round to the other wall, in that corner. Over there, and then above the fireplace. And he was still there, wasn't he? Yeah, there's nothing now. Well, we asked him to show himself, or herself. I said you were going around with it. Well, thank you for that. It's awesome. So that's a great way to end, Ben. Oh, brilliant. Showed itself for you. It did. That's cool, man. I love it when something happens. Yeah.
definitely on the SLS. So Ben, what do you reckon about this little gem hidden in the bushes? Yeah, it's hard to get to, but it's really good. Yeah, especially the uh, SLS there. Crazy. And when the voices at the beginning, Timmy, the puck was, was kicking off. Of the star, wasn't it? Amazing. You were asking questions, it was giving you answers that were probably relevant to the building and that coincide with their voices on the spirit box. But yeah, we didn't get nothing on the voice recorder, no EVPs. But yeah, so thanks for watching guys. We're gonna pack up now. It's like one o'clock in the morning. So uh, see you later, Ben, thanks for that. Thank you. Thank you, spirits. We'll speak to you again soon. Bye-bye. <laughs>